I'm Evo Taz, and welcome back to my playthrough of Diablo 4. Like the content, please like, comment, and subscribe. So in the last video, I don't know if you noticed, the subtitles were out of sync with the video. That wasn't me. Uh, that was actually in the game at the same time, so it seemed like the subtitles were faster than what they were actually saying. Anyway, let's see if it's fixed now. Alright, well, I'm not gonna lie, I've actually done this, this is the third time I'm doing this, um, I got to this point yesterday in the video, and, uh, today I launched it, I did my whole intro and everything, and then the game crashed. Let's see where it takes us. I'm 
is so dark, I pretended. Do you think I was too late? My son was wiser than even the Haradrim. But it was not in his nature to be a shepherd either. His prophecy was a warning. But rather than use it to unite the sanctuary, he let it breed chaos. Inarius, Elias, Lorath. They wanted so badly see their own meaning in the prophecy. They were blind to the simple truth of it. We are prisoners of the eternal conflict, the pawns of angels and demons. It will always be a part of us. We must fight to survive. It was so Take your hand. Then this is the future that awaits you. Why do you keep helping me? Look where we stand. I saved you in this dismal little cave. Because I sensed you could end Lilith. And that is all I want. 
I won't lie. There will come a time when we are enemies. But like it or not, right now we need each other to defeat her. Look me in the eye. Not that I'm trying to stay quiet, I'm just trying to allow well, little comments to kind of overcome my. Just stood there and watched it fall down. Don't even think of Barry. 
bringing me here, you bastard. <laughs> I'm too damn old to hold your body out of hell. <laughs> so move your hand. Let me see. I haven't taken orders from you in years, Loret. I see no reason to start now. You should have come to me instead of the cathedral. I would have shown up for you. Shared your burden. I know. And perhaps things would have gone differently with Scott's claim. And with your end. Was it enough? Will he think it was enough? Before that, I saw her cross a great sea of fire. And beyond it, lay her father's domain. We... are too late. We can't give up now. We have the stone. What should we do? I, I don't... know. I... I always thought if I didn't survive... You've been the one to finish this. You've always had the steady hand, not me. Trust your gut. It's the reason we've made it this far. You know, it's on us to figure it out. All right. It's so cool. Anyway. He gave everything. His home. His son. What was it for? You've made it back. of such a wolf. No. Mephisto. You trusted a prime evil? Trust had no part in it. Your friend saw reason instead. As should you. If Lilith takes my essence, sanctuary is lost. What do you propose? No proposals. I offer only my aid. This leads to the Cathedral of Hatred. But you must hurry. Lilith is almost there. For Lilith, but she is close. What now? We can set an ambush. I distract her. You trap her in the salt stone. Yes, a wise ploy. And you can leave the stone with me. 
I will ensure that Lilith never troubles. Something isn't right. Mephisto led you to this moment. We're in his realm. Should we really be doing what he wants? Between him and Lilith, he is the greater evil. You want to use the stone on him? Think carefully. That pass would lead to failure for all of us. Oh god, I wonder if we have to make a choice. One of the things I actually liked about the old Diablo games was the fact it was very linear and you had these thin passages like this, that's kind of where you had to go. This game seems more open world. He's afraid. It could work. We imprison Mephisto in the stone. Get back to Lorath. Then we seal the gates of hell behind us and leave Lilith here. She'll catch you before you escape. And if I'm trapped in the stone when she does, she will take my power. Don't let your hate for me blind you to common sense. Mirel. I can't trust my thoughts about Mephisto, but I trust yours. Do what you think is right. Your lives and those of all humanity depend on what you do next. Choose wisely. for you at the chapel. This better not be the last time I see you. Understand? Thank <laughs> you. 
Too bad work. meant as an escape from the eternal conflict. And yet, here we are, again. I gave you free will, and you've squandered it, wasting it on a crusade you don't understand. You chose tyranny when offered freedom. A poor legacy for my gift. Without me, you would have no victory. And its cost will be more than you can pay.
was a different colored ring. Others embrace. Eek. Four skills hit. Five or more enemies. 35% of the resource cost is required. Wow. That's actually really good. 5% off. Maximum roll. We're in the upper tier of the percentages. I'm happy with that. And if you're wondering, that fight was actually much easier than fighting Butcher, so... This was one of the first uniques I got. Flurry damaging enemies in a circle. One that I got here. Thick. Whole area is really well made. I like, I like the, uh, the environment and such. Lilith is no more. Is she trapped in the stone? No. Mephisto is. He helped us reach the Cathedral of Hatred before Lilith <sighs> did. Of course. He had a hand in all of this from the beginning, didn't he? We had to take the risk. No. I understand. Where is the stone? Nerel. She didn't come back to you? No. She must have already gone ahead to the desert chapel. We'll go after her. Quickly. I... I need to bring Dona and seal the gate to hell behind us. I will... will only slow you down. You can't do this on your own, my friend. We came together. We leave together too. Now... we are truly alone. The creators of Sanctuary, Angel and Demon, Father and Mother, are dead. They made us in their image. Their conflict is a part of us. It always will be. But is there any truth to Lilith's vision? This mad idea that we can escape the eternal conflict? These are not questions befitting an old man. I don't have much time left. This struggle is not mine anymore. Or will we walk the same path of all children who rebel against their parents? So often we simply become them. All I can do is help the Wanderer and Nerel avoid the fate of Rathma. And everyone else who tried and failed to overcome our flawed nature. Once we are back with Nerel, we will find a way. We have to. The act five is complete. We are mad. Why didn't you wait for us? Yes. Yes, that must be right. Yorin, Donan. We've lost so many to hatred. We can't lose Nerel too. Come on. I got a feeling she already being corrupted, but uh see. Norathna Will this never end? Yosef? What do you want? <sighs> Step aside. I'm here for the Haradrim. Can it wait? I'm off to bury a friend. We'll dig his grave for you. Well, that's kind. But who will dig yours? It went. The Haradrum have used their dark magics to 
bear a great evil into our world. Commit their wicked souls to the Father, and retrieve the Soul Stone. Well, I really want to use this, but I really like the abilities. Yosef. He saved my life in Nevesk. They were not our enemies. Uh, they were fools. I don't have the time for it. I am going to Skullsclan. Donan deserves to be buried with his son. I thought the dead deserved nothing, while the living are in danger. <laughs> Wise words. But I... I have a promise to keep. That's why you must ride north, ahead of me. If the cathedral doesn't have her yet, Nayrell might head for the vault. Find her. Once you're together, meet me at Doran's estate. like a beast strode right past where you stand like path of scales this is what i saw in the reflections we're close i can save you from this mother i promise i can learn how to going to leave me, aren't you? You'll find a place where I can be taken care of. Yeah, I was gonna start up here, but then she started talking, so I thought, recording there. Um... I don't want to get this as well. I don't know if I need to go across the bottom or if I should go across the bottom or across the top. See, we're going to have to get willpower if I go that way. There's a willpower there as well, though. go this way and get this we'll work our way upwards what I expected but let's not give up hope I've no sign of her that letter wasn't here before she must have left it Traveling around all over the place here. For a simple instruction, she sure is evading where she needs to be. Not in town. Why do I only hear one set of footsteps?
spent a lot of time learning this code. So I hope you remember how to read it, Morath. Because you are the last Horatrim now. My mother would have wanted me to stay with you. She believed the Horadrim had all the answers. I don't know if she'd recognize this person I'm becoming. It's hard for me to think about her right now. But then I remember you and Donan. You weren't all-knowing, Haradrim. You were bitter. You were uncertain. But... You were always true friends. That's what I hold on to. Because there is so much further to go. Your imperfection gave me hope. And we will need it to face what comes next. To face him and his brothers. But there has to be a better answer. And I have to find it. Alone. I know you want to go with me. But people have already died because I was not careful enough. I can't risk you too. If I've misjudged, the world is going to need you to survive and clean up the mistakes I leave behind. I know you don't want to hear this, but you don't get to quit. Not again. As if everything works out as I am hoping, we will never see each other again. Um, I feel that's kind of leading up to ERCs for sure. But to us, and Rod Ferguson's uh, name was there as a general manager first. Follow him on Twitter. Anyway, I actually like the game. I, I think the story was well done. Um, I feel the, the gameplay felt a bit repetitive, uh, meaning that the side missions were pretty much the same thing. Go here, collect this, come back, get a veil crystal as a reward, or get some plants as a reward, or some leather. Um, rewards felt unrewarding to tell you the truth i wasn't expecting a legendary every time from side missions but even weapons and such right or armor to kind of give you that little bump um to help you out or even well i guess we did get a couple of gems for some side missions but it would have been nice to know what your rewards were for the side missions um the game also feels 
more open world than linear. Um, a lot of the older Diablo games were very linear, meaning that there were small thin pathways that you had to run across um, to get to your objective. In this, you just have an open map and you can run wherever you like and still get to your objective, no problem, but you're not bound to a, you know, a small path you have to follow. Um, I liked the uh, the acting, the you know the the voiceovers were really well done. Um, I thought everything you know fell in place. Um, you know you're very dependent on on these legendaries, and I didn't really go out of my way to farm anything in particular. Or I I think you know enough drop that we got one of everything that we can for the rogue. Um, I, I, you know, I didn't see anything new dropping, and I don't know if we've got everything or not, but it felt like we've got multiples of every piece, pretty much. There, there's one or two that I got towards the end there, um, that I've only got one of, but I'm curious where the game kind of takes us now. The story was never a source of how you farm gear in this game. It's always been about the end game. Once you've beaten the campaign, um, that's when the game really starts in Diablo. And uh, yeah, I'm looking to see where it takes us now. Um, it's a shame a game named Diablo didn't really have Diablo in it. I was kind of disappointed in that. I mean, you know, Diablo 2, we defeat, defeat him. And then in Diablo 3, he was there again, right? And, yeah, it wasn't the main focus, but he was still in the game. So, now we have Diablo 4, and there was only talk of Diablo in uh, Act 3, I think, in reference to Prime Evil. And it was kind of cool to see, you know, Bale, uh, Diablo, and Mephisto kind of referenced as the Prime Evils. Um, kind of wish we'd communed with Diablo, but it makes sense. You know, Mephisto is... Uh, Lilith's father um, so it made sense to kind of go that route it would have been nice to see an interaction with Lilith and Mephisto at the end and that we you know intervene or something but yeah I'm curious where this whole thing leads us with Nairel and, and such and what the next DLCs bring us I did hear that um, there are two DLCs planned already it's gonna be pretty cool um, hopefully we get more gear and such and more options for builds. It literally seems like you have to go an AoE build uh, with a little bit of single target. Um, very similar to uh, Lost Ark where uh, AoE rules the game and in this it's pretty much the same thing. It rules the game because the quicker you can kill the trash and the lots of mobs the quicker you can focus on specifics of killing the elites uh, and bosses but yeah honestly I would give this game a 7.5 8 out of 10 um, again just because I found it was a bit repetitive leading up to this but I still had lots of fun you know I always loved the Diablo series and I'm gonna keep playing um, you know this is where the real end game starts and this is what I'm really gonna focus on I wanted to get the story on my channel and um, you know from beginning to end I didn't want to skip any of the cutscenes I wasn't in any rush uh, so you know everything that you see on my channel in regards to this game is from beginning to end as as it came by I didn't go out of my way to kind of over explore. I looked around a little bit just to kind of complete the uh, renowned, um, just because I wanted all the all the points, all the skill points. But at some point, you know, I realized I didn't really drop below two or three healing potions, so getting nine is a little overkill. We are playing this on World Tier Two, which is the highest I could select. Um. And, you know, now that we've beaten the game, we should unlock a capstone dungeon. Um, I might not do gameplay from beginning to end. Um, well, I don't know if there is an end uh, after you've beaten the campaign, but I might not do full gameplay of the game. 
uh, going forward. I might just show small things like capstone dungeons or, um, you know, doing certain events and or like world events and such whenever they pop up. But this is one of those games that I'll always keep playing. It always refreshes. They've introduced you know, seasons and the first season will start in a month, I believe. And it resets everything. So you still keep your characters. It just puts everyone on an even playing field. And all those people that rushed to 100 and skipped everything, they get to do that again. And it just, I guess it adds to that interest for them, right? But for me, I don't really care about rushing to the... I'm just more about enjoying the game for myself and figuring things out. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. And we'll be back with more Diablo in the next one. So then, see you later. Alright, so before we head out, Lilith has been defeated, but there is still much to do. Level up, take on new challenges across the continent. Complete Whispers of the Dead, participate in Helltide, and challenge yourself in Nightmare Dungeons to gain valuable items and crafting materials to progress your character. Continue unlocking world tiers to gain access to more features and powerful items. When you are strong enough to face the Echo of Lilith, face the Echo of Lilith in the final world tier. And a Necro just dropped on our heads. I wish we could. She's out there with a prime evil, but we've been instructed not to follow. Wouldn't even know where to start searching if we did. So, until we know more, we'll have to wait. I can't just sit idly by, waiting for word. No? Then what are you gonna do? Go after her against her will? No. You're right about Nayrel, friend. But there's still work to be done in Sanctuary. I'm going to the Tree of Whispers. Why would you do that? Because it might be our only ally left. And we may soon need allies more than ever. Fine. Go see the tree. But be very careful. Okay, we got some side missions. We got a whole bunch of strongholds. You know, I might just keep keep making content on this. Um and see where it takes us, right? Anyway, for now, we are going to stop. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.